you update it to iPhone to iOS 26 or 26.1 or even 26.2 and now your battery is draining fast. Don't worry, these are the exact settings you need to change right now to save battery life. This battery drain isn't just happening to you. A lot of iPhone users are complaining after the update. But the good news is most of it can be fixed in settings. First thing, turn on adaptive power. This is a new iOS feature that automatically adjusts performance to save battery. For this, go to the settings, battery, power mode, and turn on adaptive power. If you don't see adaptive power, that's normal. It's only available on newer iPhone models. Older iPhones won't have this option. Number two, use low power mode smartly. Low power mode is still one of the best ways to instantly stop battery drain. For this, you can go to the settings and then battery and low power mode, or even use the control center for this. You can turn it on when your battery drops below 30% or anytime you need extra hours. Number three, check which apps are killing your battery. This is huge. Some apps drain battery, even when you are not using them. For this, go to the settings and then battery and scroll down. If you see an app using way too much battery, update it, limit it, or stop using it. Number four, turn off background app refresh. Most apps do not need to refresh in the background. For this, go to the settings, general, and background app refresh. Set it off, or at least turn it off for apps you don't need. Number five, fix location services. Location services are one of the biggest battery killers. For this, go to the settings, privacy and security, and tap on location services. Change most apps to while using or turn location off completely if the app doesn't need it. Number six, adjust display and brightness. Your screen uses more battery than almost anything else. For this, go to the settings, display and brightness, or just through the control center. Now, the most important things are lower brightness, turn on auto brightness, reduce auto lock time, and turn off always on display if you have it. Number seven, limit widgets and live activities. Too many widgets and live activities constantly refresh in the background. Remove widgets you don't actually need, especially on the lock screen. Less widgets means better battery life. Number eight, reduce notifications. Every notification wakes up your screen and drains battery. Go to the settings and then notifications. Turn off notifications for apps that are not important. Number nine, turn off analytics. Apple analytics run silently in the background. Go to the settings privacy and security, and then analytics and improvements. Turn off share iPhone analytics and other analytics options. Number 10, Apple intelligence. If your iPhone supports Apple intelligence, this can also affect battery. Apple intelligence is only available on new iPhones. If you don't see it, your device doesn't support it, and that's okay. But if it is available, go to the settings, Apple intelligence, turn it off if you want maximum battery life. Number 11, update apps and restart. Make sure all your apps are updated. Developers release battery fixes all the time. And finally, restart your iPhone. It sounds simple, but it actually fixes a lot of battery bugs. Do these settings and your battery life will improve. If this helped you, like the video, subscribe for more iPhone tips, and share this with someone whose battery dies before the end of the day. See you in the next one.